Why was it decided to send the 5th Brigade to Matabili land? At the outbreak of the problems that we have in Matabeland, we initially reacted to the problem as a simple problem of law and order, and we sent the police units there. But because of the pattern of organization involving both the ex-Zebra dissidents, the political infrastructure, we got to a position where it was realized the police alone were being ineffective. We therefore decided to reinforce the police with units of the Zimbabwe National Army, integrated battalions. And this was particularly at the time when the tourists were, were kidnapped. But in the course of operations, to our disappointment, some of the Zipra elements within the National Army actually deserted during operations. And we had the ridiculous position that rather than fighting against the dissidents, we were actually facilitating uh, the process of reinforcing them. And we found that it was ineffective to use such units. And we therefore in the end decided to send uh, units of the 5th Brigade. For one, they are loyal to the government, and secondly, they wouldn't desert, and they would see to it that they carry out the task which they have been assigned uh, successfully if they can. They wouldn't desert because they were mainly ZANU supporters? They are loyal to the government. What's your view?